Hey guys, welcome to another video on the Motopress channel. My name is Valerie. Today I'm going to be talking about a much anticipated update for the hotel booking plugin. This feature rolled out with version 4.4.3 and allows displaying per night prices in the availability calendar for an individual property. Let's take a closer look at this feature and other improvements since the 4.5 version and how you can use them. But before we dive into reviewing all the enhancements, remember to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to be notified when new videos are released. So, shall we get started? With the new feature displaying nightly rates in the availability calendar on the single accommodation type page, you as a host give travelers more details up front, thus improving their checkout experience. This awesome feature is aimed at helping you build a more transparent relationship with your guests since they receive more freedom to choose the best options for their stay. To display the prices in the calendar, you need to log into your dashboard and go to Accommodation, Settings. We're going to use a General tab. Scroll down to find Display Options section and its Availability Calendar. And I'm ticking the needed boxes associated with showing prices in the calendar. You can choose whether to show the full cost or truncate the price or hide or show the currency sign. Make sure to save changes. Note that these nightly rates displayed in the calendar don't include taxes and fees. Uh, even uh, if you've enabled the show price with taxes and fees option, remember that Guests can click through the month in the calendar to compare prices even throughout the entire year. And if you have different prices for different seasons, that means your guests will see this displayed right in the availability calendar on available days. You can check those in your rates and seasons. Just reminding you, with hotel booking, you can overwrite your base rate to set seasonal rates and holiday or weekend rates. It's possible to set up different prices depending on the number of booked nights as well as the number of guests. And of course, we have a tutorial devoted to this topic. And if you haven't watched that, we recommend checking that out. It's worth saying that we've updated our WordPress hotel themes to reflect these changes and get the availability calendars across themes prepared for this great update. The calendar design will pretty much depend on your default theme settings or the calendar style you choose in the hotel booking plugin settings. For this video, I'm using the Villager theme by Motopress. As for the rest of the latest plugin updates, they also deal with the calendar delivering a more logical visualization of the booked or available dates, also with block accommodation rules taken into account. Let me give you a few examples of what I mean. Different colors indicate the status of your property. If the cell is green, the unit is open and available to book on that date. If the date is not available to book, the calendar cell will appear in pale red. This is what a booking for one night in January looks like. Then we see a five-night booking, and here is a two-night stay displayed. There are more reasons for accommodation not to be available to book. You'll see one of these reasons in the badge when hovering over the cell in your calendar. These are the booking rules I've applied for some dates in February. We see that I've added a rule that will restrict the stay on the 15th of February. In the calendar, the number 15 is crossed out and the cell itself is split diagonally. The 16th of January uh, is half grade 2. 
The color coding of the calendar makes it obvious to the user that this date is unavailable for checkout but still available for check-in. For February 21st, I've selected all three restrictions, namely not check-in, not check-out, and not stay-in. And the guests clearly see that the previous date, uh, February 20th, uh, is unavailable to check in and the date after uh, February 22nd is not available for checkout uh, for understandable reasons. We've also improved the color coding for dates in the admin calendar to better show booked and blocked days. We recommend that you update your hotel booking plugin to the latest version not just get the feature of displaying prices in the availability calendar, but also to enjoy all the latest fixes and minor improvements. To wrap things up, an availability calendar on the single accommodation type page allows your guests to get real-time information and view availability and price for their reservation dates. In addition to saving time, this feature improves guest experience right from the moment the guests make a reservation. I hope this video was useful. If so, please drop a like. And if you have any questions, leave us a comment down below. We always enjoy your comments and try to respond to each of them. Do check out the show notes below for some timestamps and useful links. Join us on social media. It's a great way to be up to date with the news from Motopress. I wish you guys the best and I'll see you in the next video.